Taiwanese Pipe Boats Across the world, unique and individual cultures produce some of the most splendid vessel designs. One of my favorite that exists is Taiwanese pipe boats. I originally knew them as Taiwanese sewer pipe boats. The lore for how these boats came into existence is something about a community that was replacing its sewer trunk pipelines and was throwing them away when a very poor individual saw an opportunity to build a boat out of the old pipes and the pipe boat craze was created. Although that is just lore, it's not known if it's true or not, and realistically speaking, pipe or pontoon boats are anything but a new idea. These boats are often referred to as PVC boats, although many are made with steel pipes. Boats are quite popular in economically challenged countries and are gaining popularity around the world. There are now boat yards and builders specializing in building these vessels. The advantages to these boats is fairly self-evident. They have fantastic buoyancy, stability, tracking, rigidity, and are inexpensive to build. They are also very difficult to sink, and the non-metal boats are inert to water corrosion. Even if some of the pipes were to become compromised, it is likely the vessel would still stay afloat and be stable. In instances where more buoyancy is required, the solution is simple. Just add more pipes underneath the vessel. If the vessel needs to be wider, then simply add more pipes to increase the width. Or if the vessel needs to be longer, simply add pipe to pipe fittings and extend the vessel. This means that later in the vessel's life, it can be adapted inexpensively to accommodate its operator's need, or in some case, grow with its operator. The options are endless. The only real downside to these vessels is they are not fast and become extremely inefficient at anything above hull speed. I have to admit, that I have given a lot of consideration to maybe one day building one of these for myself. I hope you liked this episode, and if you want to support the channel, please like and subscribe. If you have any suggestions for an interesting boat or ship you would like me to cover, let me know in the comment section. So without taking any more of your time, this is Thor, signing out.